welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're just going to be doing a chit chat and sit with me while we get ready together. So go ahead and grab your makeup bag, grab your mirror, and grab all your stuff because we're going to be sitting down and talking, chica. Yeah. Let's start, of course, with my two skincare. Guys, how's your day going? What are you doing? What do you guys usually do? I don't even know what to do. <laughs> like, I just upload videos all the time. Like, for you guys, they're ready. You know? This feels so good! I say this all the time, but it literally feels like a freaking facial on your face. Guys, what is your favorite show to watch on Netflix? Right now, I'm re-watching Shameless. I don't know if you guys have seen that. It's so good. It's, there's a lot of sex and stuff, so if you're under the age, please don't go watch it. But, if you're like my age or whatever, you should definitely watch it. It's freaking funny. And crazy and emotional shit. Okay, let's pick up some primer. We're gonna pick up that same primer, the Glassy Pretty Fitter Glassy Skin Balm. I think that's the first time I've ever said it correctly. Y'all should be proud of me. Come on, like, uh, 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 what? I'm so hungry. Yo, know, I have quite a few products out today. Some of them, or like, they're most of them are new, are like the same ones I always use. Besides these lashes, these are new. And then I also picked up a powder. I don't think I've ever really used a powder on my channel, like an actual powder powder that matches my skin color, besides like the setting powders and stuff. Um, but this I'm gonna try and use it to set the rest of my face rather than using sandy, uh, setting powder excuse me, to set the rest of my face. So we're gonna try that today and see if it avoids a little bit of cakiness that I've been having under my eyes. I don't know why, but really annoying. So we're just gonna let this sit a little bit longer because I'm also thinking maybe I'm not letting my skincare and like the primer set long enough, you know? Like I'm just rushing and ready to just start my makeup. So I'm just gonna take my time and um, honestly, I think I'm just gonna start with my brows just right here and just let the rest of my skin just set. So we can just go ahead and do our brows. That's a good idea. Oh guys, look at my new mirror. This is my new mirror. Yes, isn't it so cute? I got it from work, um, or this guy from work gave it to me because we had Secret Santa. Look, and it has three different settings. I didn't show you my video whenever. I was like, oh, I'm gonna show you guys. It has three different settings. So one, two, three. It's really freaking awesome. It's just like really sensitive, so any like little touch and that shit turns off. The lighting is like better in here now though, right? Okay. Now I'm gonna be picking up the Anastasia. <laughs> I'm gonna be picking up the Anastasia Beverly Hills Eye Brow Powder, and this is in the shade Auburn. And of course, we're gonna be dipping into that darker shade.
Bust it down, turn around, fuck it all the way up. Bust it down, turn around, fuck Look. Let's get it straight. I went ahead and finished my brow and like, you know, we're just getting ready together so I don't really like, feel like I have to do step by step, but I'm just so used to telling you guys. I started eating cause I was like super hungry and then I was like, oh shit, I'm recording. <laughs> Do you guys ever just do your makeup and then don't go anywhere? Or like you just go to your parents' house or something? That's me all the time. <laughs> and then those are the days where your makeup comes out real good. Y'all, that is the straightest cut crease I've ever done in my life. I'm not even exaggerating. Now, it took me such a long time to learn how to do this, so, like, not even perfectly, but, like, I even struggle sometimes, so. But it took me a while. So don't y'all be thinking I just, like, randomly. I was like, oh, let me try cut crease, and boom, I knew how to do it. Hell no. That took me a long time to learn how to do it. It might have been easy for some people, but... My eyes are so big, it's hard. So I had to like figure out how high do I do it so, you know what I mean? Like the other shade doesn't go on the other color of the lid or, you know? It was just really annoying. Okay, now I'm just gonna go over that shade again on the top, just cause I got a little bit of that lighter shade. Do you guys have any favorite chips? I don't really have favorite chips, but I like a lot of chips. Like, not even like basic ass hot Cheetos either. I like, I like some basic chips. I like Doritos. I like Hot Cheeto Puffs. I like, I don't know. Takis, I don't really eat them anymore. They hurt my stomach. Um, hmm.
sometimes I still struggle like getting nervous of putting the shade up so high but I know it's like I know it looks good you know what I mean it ends up looking good and this is really all I do whenever um, I'm not recording I just eat while I do my makeup <laughs> Guys, if we can get my channel to 200 subscribers, I will literally do a giveaway. We are almost there. Hello, make sure you make sure blah, blah, blah. make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. So that is your chance to enter my giveaway if we get to 200 subscribers. I've been trying to like turn my head to the side so y'all can see. It's so hard. Not hard, but it's like a different angle I'm not used to, you know? <laughs> it's hard to chew into my eyebrow. Y'all, the other day I did my eyebrows. I thought they looked good. I swear they looked good. And then I looked in the mirror and I, in the car and I was like, oh, they look horrendous. And I still wear them out because it's already too late. You know, I'm already in the fucking car. Breaking out and it's so ugly. 
What the heck? <clears throat> Getting ready takes so long. Sometimes I honestly hate being a girl. <laughs> Just because it takes so long to get ready. I know I can get ready real fast if I wanted to, but sometimes I really enjoy just like sitting here and taking my time to get ready, you know? Guys, I'm gonna be honest with you, the one thing that I honestly really do hate is how long it takes to fill in freaking eyebrows. <sighs> like, I like how they look after, I just hate taking the time <laughs> to fill them in sometimes. Sometimes I just wanna be like, and then they're just on. <laughs> Maybe I'm crazy. Who knows? Guys, I bought a, a really cool hair mask. If you guys want to see that in a video, make sure you guys let me know. I'm really not ever sure what guys, uh, what, what guys, what you guys want to see in a in, the, in my videos. So. After it dries a little, it's always a little bit like harder to blow it out and to not like pull on it, you know what I mean? You just gotta be patient. I was gonna remind myself that I'm such an impatient person. If you know me, you know that. This new little trick that I learned is if you just pick up a little bit and then you just like pat it into where you place the concealer and instead of baking you just like literally keep patting this setting powder until it's all melted into your like skin pretty much so there's no creasing throughout the day or anything and I like to look up so it literally gets into all the creases and everything. Okay, now I'm gonna pick up the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Powder. This is in the shade Neutral. And I'm gonna be picking up a big fluffy brush. Whoa. And we're gonna use this brush and just swirl it around in the pan. And then we're gonna tap it on our face. 
we're just gonna tap it so because we don't want to move I don't know why I said so because we don't want to move any of the foundation or the concealer or anything like that we want to make sure everything just stays in place I really want to see if this will help my skin, like, the makeup stay, you know what I mean? Because, like I said, I've been having, like, creasing issues and stuff like that. So, fingers crossed. And I'm just going to use the rest of whatever's on my brush and just go over my skin again. Making sure it's set everywhere. Y'all, sometimes it's really hard, like, whenever I want to do a get ready with me. It's really hard to not explain what I'm doing because I'm so used to just sitting here and be like, okay, now this, okay, and now I'm gonna do this. I think I'm gonna do like a really, I really wanted to do just like a natural look today, but then I ended up doing eyeshadow, so. We all know how that goes. Why can't I open this? They make shit complicated to open because people like to steal stuff. And if they hear you opening it, they're gonna be like, what are you doing? And that's probably like, oh damn, I just messed up my hair. And I'm just gonna be like, dang, you took forever. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Eyelashes can be really uncomfortable. So that's why I don't wear them too often. Because my natural lashes honestly are already pretty long. But then I'm like shit. I really should start like wearing them more. Because it really does make a difference in the looks. Like in the eye looks, you know? Because you can have a really dramatic ass eye look or with like a really dramatic wing. you guys have been enjoying my videos i've uploaded so many freaking videos i've been trying to like make sure to keep you guys updated on like what's going on or like new things for you guys to see or watch i mean i don't know i could not get that bitch on like are you gonna stick to my eye or not She really did not want to. She said, I don't want to go on your eyes, sis. Not today. Well, you really got much of a choice. Hello, when the house is so quiet, because then I can really, I feel like I can really, like, be up in my videos how I want to be. That's why sometimes I whisper, because there's always somebody here. And I don't get shy at all because everybody and their mom knows I record videos. Because it's really all I talk about. 
not all I talk about, but when people bring it up, I get really excited about talking uh, about talking about it. And uh, so, of course, I'm in my room. I'm gonna record videos. So when I know people are here, I tend to feel like like I they don't I know they don't care, but I just feel awkward because I know they can hear me. And I'm like, ew, fuck, they think I'm talking to myself. But really, in general, I'm not talking to myself. I'm talking to you guys that watch my videos. Duh. But not a lot of people understand the whole like, concept of YouTube, if that makes sense. Like my mom, she's like, why do you want to record that? That's too personal. Stephanie, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, mom. Like, when people get famous on YouTube, like, what do you think they blog about? Hello? Like, their life. Like, their personal life. People want to know. People, you know what I mean? I'm not saying that I'm going to get famous, but... Shoot, if somebody was making videos on YouTube and I'm subscribed to them, I'm going to know what they're doing, you know what I mean? So, I don't know. That's just me. And that's my mentality, so... Yeah, you guys are going to start seeing a lot of random shit on my YouTube channel. This Isla came out so pretty. After adding this shade right here, it like finished it off. Like it gave it that missing pop that I was looking for. I love when I feel good because then I know I look good and then it's just gonna be a good day. I'm just gonna pat this on. <clears throat> I'm gonna try and start applying my makeup different and see what works better, you know what I mean? And see like, yeah, my technique works, you know what I mean? So we're just gonna start by patting it and then lightly do circular motions to blend it out. So I'm gonna try and just concentrate it right here and just lightly contour. We're not gonna do it as dark as I normally do. Just blending it and blending it. I've been watching a lot of like other YouTubers. Um, I really like Rosenbin. She's really, really pretty. I've learned a few things from her. Um, who else? Nikki Tutorials is pretty cool. She doesn't really upload that often though. I just feel like people get so caught up in like the whole I'm famous. They forget that, that the whole point of them getting famous was the whole YouTube thing, you know? I don't know. That's just me and what I've seen. My skin is getting so much better and better and better. I know right now I'm like breaking out, but it's clearing up on its own. And I also feel like my makeup skills are getting better. 
<laughs> not to be <laughs> complimenting myself, but you know, fuck it up, sis. I love ColourPop highlight. What the heck? Oh, it's like an orgasmic makeup freaking. Oh, look at that. Look at that highlight. It's so pretty. I'm glad I already fixed my hair, so I won't be here my mom. But that's okay. Where are you at? <laughs> no offense, mom, but. Damn, sometimes the sisters want to take your time to get ready. Yeah, I love this little brush. This is from the Brow Bar little palette thing that I got from my BoxyCharm. It's so like convenient for like multiple things. I'm not even kidding. I need a guy. I love like orangey shades. Okay, since I picked up that little purple liner and I applied it right here, you guys will see it right now when I take that zoomed in picture that I always do at the end of my videos. I'm gonna pick up the Lilac You A Lot palette. We're gonna dip it into like a purple shade. I wanna smoke it out on the bottom. Just to give it, oh yes, a little bit of personality. with this look out of my ass because I did not know what I was going to do. I don't really do good of getting ready with me because all I want to do is just explain what I'm doing. But I think it's really good to, I guess, connect with you guys more and for you guys to like genuinely know like I legit care about my videos. Like I don't just be uploading random crap, you know what I mean? Just to get famous. You know what we're missing? That's what I'm like looking at my face like I need some blush. <clears throat> so no wait, no makeup wipe, honestly. I don't really care. That scratch mark bugs me so bad. It just really looks so ugly. Like, today I'm off, so. I'm just using whatever's left on the brush. I didn't add any product or anything. Make sure you guys comment down below if you'd like to see more of these videos. I feel like that was pretty cool. It wasn't as awkward as I thought, as awkward as I thought it would be. And I kind of like creating like random looks, you know what I mean? And seeing like what I can do. Okay guys, and that is the end of today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed getting ready with me. And yeah, I don't know if you guys like this video, make sure you guys comment down below so I know to make more of these videos. I love, like I said, I love being put on the spot and just creating random looks. This literally isn't something that I would just like come up with. It just, I just went with the flow and just went with whatever I thought would look good. So I think it came out pretty decent and I think I did pretty good. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe Subscribe, hit that little button so you know the next time I upload a video and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video.